This is Karen Ramsey of Super Healthy Children, and I am here at the Turtle Lake Refuge Cafe in Durango, Colorado. And here is my daughter, Gabriella Ramsey. <laughs> And she is preparing food for tonight. Um, and I'm going to be speaking here tonight. I'm so fortunate. And there's some people already outdoors waiting, waiting for their food and for their lecture. And here's Gabriella. Gabriella, what are you preparing this evening at Turtle Lake? Sure. So, um, first, I'm taking a hollyhock leaf, um, which is a perfect little burrito leaf because it holds together really well and they're really tasty. And then I made this um, taco meat, and that's um, walnuts Ooh. and sun dried tomatoes and onion and um, wow. lemon juice and cumin and chili powder. Mm. Then, um, and then I shredded up some carrots, and I'm putting that on top. And then I'm taking some sprouts and just garnishing them with a little... What kind of sprouts do you have? Um, well, we have a lot of different kinds, but today um, I'm just using sunflower sprouts and buckwheat sprouts, greens. And then, yeah, that's the little taco. And see the hollyhock perfectly holds it together. Ooh, that's adorable. Really pretty. With a little tomato on top. Wow. And then I'm serving two tacos and a large salad. <gasps> How gorgeous and green is that? That's like real garden food. And all of these, uh, all the sprouts are grown right here. Yep. Yeah, you should take a video of that room too. Yeah. We definitely. call them microgreens. Microgreens. Yeah. The official name are microgreens. And this is Katrina Blair, founder of Turtle Lake Refuge. And she's helping prepare all this wonderful, delicious raw food cuisine. We're making some green chips with um, elm leaves here from our local. Chinese elm, and then we're using some hollyhock leaves as well for chips, and a little bit of mugwort leaves, oh. and our marinade is a little uh, almond onion, mm. lemon, cool. we use a little bit of um, beet sugar, which is just dried beets, to make it pink. How pretty, and you're going to blend that up and put it on top of those green chips? And then we'll dry them. And they're very, oh. very delicious. That sounds yummy. Here we go. Just pink color. Isn't that beautiful? Wow. And then you're pouring that on all the greens. And then we marinate them mm. a little bit and then put them into the dryer. Wow. Cool. 